Sickle cell disease is something that you hardly ever hear people talk about, but it's the most common genetic disease. It affects 100,000 people in the U.S. I see kids and families battling with it every day, but I sometimes wonder how many people even know about it, let alone how challenging the condition can be. Hi, I'm Zion. I'm 11 years old and I have sickle cell. So Zion, tell me what it feels like when you're having a bad day or you can't do most of the things that other kids can. It's hard not doing what everybody else does because I have sickle cell, but still kind of fun trying to do it. It's hard not doing what all the other kids can do, like running and playing tag. Sickle cell disease takes a heavy toll on children and families. Pain can strike at any time, so parents never know when they'll need to rush their child to the emergency department. And many kids need regular blood transfusions, requiring frequent trips to the hospital. It can be very disruptive for kids and their families. The normal day-to-day -day activities of life, like school, work, time with the family, and friends can seem out of reach. So Zion, do you have to miss much school? I miss about three months of school. How often do you have to go to the hospital? I go to the hospital every three to four weeks. A couple weeks ago, I had to go to the emergency room because I had sickling in my ribs and I couldn't breathe as well. Cincinnati Children's established one of the first centers of its kind in 1971 to help children and families coping with sickle cell disease. Our doctors and researchers pioneered many of the treatments for sickle cell that are now used nationwide. Zion, tell me how you feel about coming to Cincinnati Children's. I love it here. It's awesome. And I like child life and all the people that work here. I even like the CEO, Michael. The people who work here make me feel awesome. And I really like it here because I get to, to play in the playroom. Everyone at Cincinnati Children's is committed to helping patients with sickle cell disease have the best possible quality of life. And it's not just about the treatments in the clinic. It's about research and hope. Our team won't stop until they find a cure to end the suffering caused by this disease. So Zion, what do you have to say to the doctors and researchers working to cure sickle cell disease? It makes me feel good that they're trying to find a cure for us and all my friends that have sickle cell. My hope for Zion and all kids with sickle cell disease is that they will no longer have to suffer. They can just be kids and live healthy, happy, carefree lives. My sister has sickle cell too. The little ones help me walk like down the steps to the bathroom. Sometimes it's hard for me to walk down steps. Sometimes it's hard for me to walk. When it's cold out, the pain can get really bad. In hot weather, it's not as bad. As long as I'm drinking a lot of water, it doesn't get as bad. I'm fine. The one thing that I do want to say is that a lot of people who don't know much about sickle cell don't really understand that wherever the blood flows in the body, they can sickle and they can have crisis and they can have pain. So as you can imagine, that's everywhere and that's anywhere. So when the temperature changes, especially like right now when it goes from warm to cold, a lot of kids experience a lot of pain crisis at this time. 
So some kids are treated with narcotics. Some kids may just need Motrin, a lot of rest, water. It just really depends on the kid because every kid's different. We get blood transfusion every three to four weeks. I'm very optimistic about the research with sickle cell disease. I think that there will be a cure within my lifetime. And when there are no more children to actually treat or see with sickle cell disease, we're going to rejoice because then we'll know we've done our job and we found a cure. There's lots of kids just like me with sickle cell disease, and we really, really need your help. It would really be nice if you could donate for us, please. We really need it. It's for a good cause, too. Donate. It's very good to donate. We need it. So, it's not like we're buying video games here. <laughs>